Hey guys, Matt Zach here. Welcome back to another video where today we are back on NBA 2K11 Part 35. I don't know if y'all can tell, but I have a brand new microphone. I uploaded a YouTube short on it not too long ago, and it's a Blue Yeti mic. I'm still figuring out everything with it. Um, I've changed a lot of my OBS settings, and I think I have it where I want it. I will, of course, be changing stuff most likely um, as I put out more videos, but this is the first video with it. So if anything does sound different, uh, that's the reason. I'm going to go back and watch Watch this video of course and make sure that everything does sound good um i did a test on it earlier and it sounded just fine anyways let's go and upgrade my player now for its skill points now i did see a comment saying why i'm missing a lot of shots and it's because my offensive awareness is low and i believe my consistency is also low so with that being said we're actually gonna bump up our offensive awareness to 80. that's a big jump but it's gonna help us for sure let's do 62 there we'll jump up that consistency and then we'll do a defensive awareness as well and that will put us at a 62 overall but today we are facing the charlotte bobcats we're 20 and 25 we had a crazy game against the hornets so hopefully we can get off to a good start against the bobcats so without further ado let's begin big dog as he made his arrival showing up earlier this afternoon we're in the place they call Oracle Arena in Oakland, California, the home of the Warriors, where we're going to broadcast today's game live. I get everybody alongside Clark Kellogg. This is Kevin Harlan. Glad you could join us today. Taking a look at Charlotte, they like their chances, but this could be a tough game for them. Facing up against a talented roster, they'll have to show that they're the better team. You know, they've not had any trouble with this team so far. They're undefeated against them in their prior meeting, so you would think that they've got tremendous confidence when they face them. So the Bobcats starting five. Jackson teams with Wallace on the perimeter. Tyrus Thomas out there with Nazi Muhammad and Augustine. And for Golden State, big dog in a point guard. All right, we need to win this game badly. The last time we played this team, it was pretty close. We ended up losing, though. And today, I'm just going to have to play really smart. That's an open shot. Thank you. I made a shot. Let's go. I'm hoping to not repeat what happened last time where I just couldn't get anything freaking going. Hoping to have a way better game on this one and not cost my team the game. Oh, they tried an alley-oop and missed it. Let's go, Lee. Got the rebound. And I'm going to get the turnaround slam dunk. That was perfect. I'm also looking to play very smart this game. I don't want to make any dumb passes. I don't want to commit any bad turnovers. I want to play tight defense, but I still have not been able to full on practice. This should be the last game where I don't practice. I'm definitely going to be practicing right after this recording. There you go, Monte. What a shot. Oh, they're leaving me open. Oh, come on, dude. That's bull crap. Monte, big pass. Come on, Monte, get it in. Oh, my gosh. Dude, every time I pass you the ball, that's exactly what happens. Dude, that literally looks like it's going in, and then it's just like, nope, you're fat. Dude, I might just have to upgrade my freaking mid-range shot as well. There we go. That was really interesting, but you know what? I got the layup there, so I'm fine with it. All right, I've already taken five shots. One of them, I was wide open, so I had to take it. I'm going to try to get my teammates a bit more involved. It looks like I'm already getting moved to shooting guard, which probably means where he got rid of Monte and put Steph in, right? Yep, I see Steph. Okay. There you go. What a nice deflection. Come on. Oh, there we go. Give me that. Oh, <laughs> What a slam. Let's go. Really like to get an assist here or maybe even a rebound. I know I'm not the biggest guy in terms of rebounds, but it'd be nice to get something here. Oh, come on. Ah, uh, missed it, but be drink. Come on, put it in. Let's go. All right. I literally had to put something up, dude. The clock like ran out. Come on, please make it in. I know you have the worst jump shot in history, but please. Oh my gosh. Why do you suck at shooting? Sagging off me? I don't think so. All right, 11 points. Not bad. I'd like an assist, and I need to play a lot tighter defense on Jackson. But other than that, not too bad. Okay, you're just going to take me out. That's interesting. Bench, please. Okay, there you go. Bench, that's what I like to see. 23 to 16. I have to play top-notch defense, man. I just have to. Although I freaking rag on Monte a lot, I am starting to depend on him a lot more recently. Oh, Beadrin with the nice steal there. There you go, bud. 
Give me that. Oh my gosh. I even got a rebound and y'all still can't make it. I don't know why. I just had a feeling that Reggie was going to miss it. So I'm like, yeah, I'll sit here for the rebound. Oh, what a block. There you go, Beadrin. Dude, this man can't score a bucket if he tried. But you know what? His defense is actually good. Oh, dude, I gave him that perfect separation. Nice bucket, Monte. I think I just ran into DJ and he couldn't get to freaking Monte in time. Ellis! Oh my gosh! The assist, baby. Let's go. Come on, get on DR. Get on him. Get on him. Oh my gosh, Beadrin! Is a monster today, dude. Monte makes a man run, Beadrin. Oh my gosh. Why is he so good this game? All right, Beadrin. Where's this guy been since I got traded here? Dude, he's got a couple steals, couple blocks, a lot of rebounds, like a few points in there too. Like, all right, man. So if I shut him down from three, that's really going to help our chances here. Dang, man. Oh, get in there, Williams. Right there. Oh, dude. Come on. Oh, knock that one down, boys. Let's go. If they score another one here, I'm probably going to call a timeout just so I can stop their run a bit and stop their momentum. There we go. Stopped him there. Big pass to me. Why not let it fly? Ah, I was like, yeah, just why not? Not going to be taking as many threes now that I've already taken three this game. Perfect. Monte right here. Oh, way in the foul. Dude, as soon as Monte got that, I freaking ran, dude. All right, give me my free throw. Looks like we got David Lee. Perfect. A little late, but I'll take it. Augustine's either going to pop one. No, okay. I thought he was going to pop one or try to get a screen off. Come on, Ellis. Oh, you have so much space. Ellis, put it up. LSU. Oh my gosh, Reggie. Jeez, Reggie. That was such a slam from Reggie. Golly. You don't have to do that to him, Reggie. Golly. That was almost a really bad pass. Beadrin? Almost. All right. Let's take our time here, man. Take our time. No need to rush, man. Monte, wide open. Golly, Monte. I really want to be more of a team player. That's why I'm going to learn field general and just how to move the floor a lot better. Okay, I'm just wide open. Like, I have to shoot that, guys. Like, I know I said threes, but, like, I'm wide open. I'm not going to, like, refuse that. 41 seconds left in this one. I feel like our defense has been really good this game. We've been able to hold Charlotte to 27. We're up to 44 points, like, not a bad game so far. All right, we're probably going to try to hold this for the very last play of the game, although it's like a two. Okay, well, David Lee has other plans, apparently. We're ending this on a high note, actually. 44-29. Scored 19 points, a rebound. I have two assists. Not bad. I feel like I'm playing good team basketball. There's nothing quite like the NBA on a Friday night. Welcome, everyone, as we bring you our HP Halftime Report. A tremendous start for the Warriors. Right now, they're not in contention as far as the conference standings go, and that's something they'll need to address this season. Monte Ellis playing with confidence. He's got 13 points, also pulled down four rebounds. A scrappy effort by Charlotte. Great ball control offensively. The turnover differential, a major advantage right now. Their top scorer is Steven Jackson. He has 11 points and has added a couple assists in this one, too. A lot of points on the board between these two. They've led the charge in scoring for their teams. And that's all for us. We hope to see you back next time. So usually I don't do this until late in the game, but right now DJ only has three points, two assists, and he's, I mean, he's only shot two times. So I've been able to hold him out pretty well. All right, same mentality, guys. Let's come in here, not get cocky. Let's do smart shots, play great defense, all right? Oh, yes, sir. The long two. I was kind of hoping it was a three, but you know what? It's fine. Oh, get the heck out of here, Jackson. What do you think you're doing in my house? Oh, Jackson misses it again. I got to go, got to go, got to go. Get off me. And the foul. There you go, boys. Dude, they're already starting to play close up. This is interesting from them. Keep playing the exact same way. Don't change anything. We are playing great. And he's actually helped 
this team creates scoring opportunities off its defense. There you go, Lee. Honestly, I thought he was going to just pump a shot immediately. That's why I blocked. Lacking on defense a little bit. I got to get back into the groove of it, man. I can't be slacking. All right, Augustine is about to be on fire. I have to stay on him. All right, he's on fire, man. Gosh dang it. All right, guys, we're starting to slip off a bit. I'm about to call another timeout because we got to get DJ off of this, dude. All right, looks like Sacramento lost another game. All right, we're going to keep playing. I might call a timeout here very soon, though. All right, I'm starting to play really freaking bad, boys. On Oh, man. Oh, my gosh. Guys, please. There we go. Okay, we're calling a timeout. We got to call a timeout here, dude, and reset. I've had two really awful dog crap passes. I'm playing a little too loose. I have to stay. I have to keep on my toes, man. There you go, Reggie. All right. Just get instantly blocked, Reggie. Good job. Oh, man. I'm even missing slam dunks, dude. How? Come on, Monte. Make the... Oh, my gosh. Dude, what is happening? Now we can't make a shot, dude. It seems like the Bobcats could. Now we can't. We got Utah, Milwaukee, Chicago... Phoenix and then Denver. Denver is going to be an important game to win. That might actually be the first time I'm actually playing against Denver because Carmelo is on the Nuggets in this game. There you go. Thank you, Ellis. Get us out of this slump we're in. Really? David Lee leads in rebounds. All right. He's beating Tim Duncan and Howard and Al Jefferson. Golly. There you go. Oh my gosh, David Lee. You should have like, you should have put that up, man. You had a chance at the basket. Oh, no, 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 get the ball. Oh, my gosh. Please get rid of it, Monte. Oh, my gosh, dude. Yeah, I'm getting really tired, so I'm trying to not take, like, any crazy shots here. I got blocked there. Like, I just said no crazy shots, and I immediately get blocked. All right. We're going to call another timeout here. I don't want the Bobcats to get any sort of, like, momentum going whatsoever. All right. It looks like we're taking Monte out. We're getting Pargo, Wright, and Beijins. Golly. There you go, foul. Let's go, let's go. So the question is, Coach, are you going to take me out in the fourth or are you going to make me play the entire fourth? Because the last game, I think you took me out three times. This game, you've only taken me out once. Pargo faded away on a three. No way. All right, there we go. All right, very rough third quarter, dude. That was not good. We started off really well, and then it seemed like as the third quarter went on, we just struggled. The Bobcats are struggling as well, but we we can't be playing like that at all. Here's the Sprite Spark of the game. Lose the stretch by the Warriors that garners the Sprite Spark today. With their run in the second quarter, they jumped on them early and have continued to hold their ground, guys. Great, Doris. That big scoring run being a difference maker, Clark, in this game. Well, it often comes in spurts, Kevin. Spurtability is what I call it, and that's what happened today. I think he might take me out here. Yep, okay. Bench, please, for the love of everything. Wow. Good stuff, guys. Good freaking stuff. My bench did well. Now it's time for me to come in and kind of clean up. All right, we got a 20-point lead now. Let's not blow it, boys. Let's play smart, smart defense, smart passing. Let's do what we need to do. Nope. Oh, come on. That's bull. He still made that. Dude, he was like almost sideways. Dude, I need my starters back in, man. Come on. I can't get around to Augustine. Get out. There you go, Lee. There you freaking go. Big pass. No, right. You could have easily hit that, dude. That was easy. Oh, they left Curry open. Curry's going to shoot that all day, man. All right, they are taking me out of the game. I don't really like that decision at all. But you know what? We're still here. I might be able to get... Nope, never mind. Dang, I didn't even get to score a point. But you know what? That's fine. We're going to win the game. Let's go. Big win for us, boys. Good stuff. Towards the end of the game, like, I really struggled, especially in the fourth. I was really just trying to play as smart team basketball as possible and not just take crazy amounts of shots like i usually do and it looks like i get player of the game so all in all works out but this is a humongous win we just beat a team that's ranked fourth in the east i had 25 points a rebound two assists a block and two turnovers and if you look i didn't take as many shots as i usually do usually i take about 30 shots a game this game i only took 18 ellis with 21 points five rebounds four assists good stuff dj heated up in the second half which was 
really bad for me. Uh, 17 points, a rebound, five assists, two steals. And if we look at my performance, he actually beat me. I was up and I guess he beat me, but you know what? I don't really care. We got the win. I had those two really bad turnovers, but other than that, like I think I played as good as I could have in the first and then the second half, you know, I fell off, but we still won. What is team chemistry like at this point in the season? How do you feel the guys get along both on and off the court? I feel like we get along great, you know, especially recently. Um, I feel like I've gotten to play with the team a lot better in a way. Things are a lot better and things are going to get a lot better once I learn field general stuff like that. Being a part of this team is a lot of fun, straight up. I think we get along real well. These guys are great on the court and off the court. Uh, I've never had a better group of teammates to be around, truthfully. Whether it's going over to each other's houses for barbecues, playing cards on the team, playing, whatever. We always doing stuff together, and that's the important thing. Good relationships off the court are only going to help us come game time. All right, but like I said, humongous W. That was probably the biggest W we've had. Let's go, new shoes. I might actually change those because I need to start stealing more, and that could help. Got a couple skill points there, which was pretty good. Let's actually go and look at the headlines. I just want to see where our chemistry at. Our chemistry is at 20% now. We're 21 and 25. We have two wins in a row. I believe as of right now, we are one win. One win right now. One or two wins out from the eighth seed. But thank you guys for watching the video. Guys, like, comment, and subscribe, and turn on post notifications. That way you guys don't miss any of the videos I post. Again, this is a new mic, so this is the first time I'm using it. I hope I sound better, and I hope it sounds good on the video. Thank you guys for all the love and support, and January is going to be amazing. I'm going to be able to post a lot more, so stay tuned for that. Thank you guys so much for watching the video, and I hope you guys have a great day.